I'll be giving you a complete preview of Shopify Dawn's theme so you can decide if it's the right fit for your store. So in terms of the overall, this theme was developed by Shopify and it is a completely free theme. It's a minimalist theme that lets product images take the center stage and includes support for a mega menu, a sticky header, as well as quite a few other features such as cart notes. It makes it easy to create a blog, add product reviews, it adds in image zooms as well as enhanced search, a sticky header, a mega menu, product filtering, as well as recommended products. It also works with the latest Shopify features. It's speed tested and approved and includes free high resolution photos as well as free theme updates. So let's look at the demo store and we can see exactly what it looks like. After that, I'll show you what it looks like when installed and the different settings and customizations you can make. So we look at the demo here, very slick theme. The colors are nice and this homepage I think looks great. It includes probably just about everything you're looking for in a homepage. We take a look at the mobile as well. It does look good there too. And as mentioned, it does let your product photos take center stage. You can see the different menus, sub menus, as well as the sticky header on top. We can see this one says free shipping available on all orders. We take a look through here. If we go to the product pages, we can see our different variant options or quantity selectors or different add to cart buttons. It's going to include these tabs nicely. So you can just compress certain information and make it easy for the customer to find what they're looking for. You can add more details to the product page as well, besides just the description and the images. If we go and add something to the cart, we can go and view our cart. So the cart page looks good as well. And it has our footer links as well as a newsletter subscribe options. We can see the social media links. So overall, it covers a lot of the bases, especially when you're just starting out on Shopify. As it's free, I would encourage you just to check it out if it's something you're considering. And so let's see that exact process and what it would look like. So on the left hand side menu in your Shopify dashboard, if you've created your account already, you can go to online store and under themes, if you want to add it. And if you don't already have it here, you can go to add theme under theme library. You can visit the theme store here. This will open up the Shopify official theme store. And if we go to explore themes, you can filter by free Then we can find Don right here. So if we click on it, you can hit try theme and this will install on your store. So next let's take a look at the customization options. So if we scroll Scroll back to the dashboard under themes. We go here to the center of the page. This will be our currently installed theme. You can see here by current theme, I can click on customize and this will bring us to the theme editor. So just about every Shopify theme will follow this format. If you've never been to the theme editor before on the left hand side, you'll see our overall options. We can see the sections, theme settings and app embeds. The center will be kind of our preview on how everything looks. Then if we double click on anything, on the right hand side, we'll get more details that we can edit. And it's gonna change here based on the page we select. We can see the different product pages, collection pages, blog post pages. Now there's quite a bit in here, so I'm not gonna go over to everything in this video. Let's just take a look at some of the overall sections you can add to the home page. So if we go to the left hand side, as we are on the home page here, I can click add section. I can see quite a few different pre-built features such as featured collections, featured products, collection lists, image banners, slides, collages, multi-columns, multi-rows. If I click on feature collection, I can see this was added to the bottom here. If we want to customize this, I can click on the featured collection. I can go and change it and select a different collection. Maybe I just want to click my bundles here. There's no products in there. So let's just go to camping. I can start to see some camping bags show up from my demo store. To save that, I just have to go to select in the bottom right. And I can click save on top to finalize my settings. So the last bit of this preview, let's dive into one of the products. So if I double click on this, this will load my product page here. If I want to add anything, I can go to add blocks. I can select from any of these pre-built theme blocks elements. Maybe it's a product rating or a collapsible row. It really just depends on what you're looking to add. So overall, there are quite a bit of pre-built customization. It adds for a lot of pre-built blocks and it makes it really easy, especially if this is your first Shopify store. And as mentioned, it is completely free. So even if you don't like it or you want to upgrade later on, it makes it very easy to do so as this didn't cost you anything. You also get a lot of customization under theme settings for the different colors, the typography, the buttons, the button sizes, you can customize your logo. But I think for most stores, especially at the beginning, this is just gonna include everything you kind of need out of the box. It's gonna make it easy to set up. It integrates with Shopify very nicely as it was developed by them. I know when I first started, I spent tons of time trying to find out the best theme, taking a look around. I considered paying for different themes. But at the beginning, especially when you're starting, you kind of just want to get a storefront up. You can then add these customizations later, but out of the box, this is gonna work pretty well for a lot of stores, unless you have different options, such as huge collections or a lot of specific features. But you can get those through different apps 
apps on the Shopify app store as well. Before I go, I want to say that if you've made any sales on Shopify, you know how hard it is to keep track of your profits. That's where our sponsor ProfitCalc comes in. It's the one click profit calculator available for your Shopify store. All you have to do is select the date range you're looking for to get real time calculations. It'll give you a ton of different insights and metrics so you can truly understand your store's performance. It's going to sync seamlessly with all your different ad accounts from Facebook, Google, Snapchat, Bing, Pinterest, and TikTok, as well as many other cost of goods sold options. You can find it in the Shopify app store by searching ProfitCalc. There's also a link in the description below to access the app listing directly. From there, you can get a 15-day free trial so you can test drive everything for yourself and get a clear understanding of your store's profitability. So this is going to conclude the video here. I hope the preview helped understand more about the Dawn theme, how it's customized, and some of the different features it has. It's an extremely popular theme from Shopify, and again, it's also completely free. If you enjoyed this video, I would love it so much if you mash that like and subscribe button below. If you have any questions, leave a comment, but thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you in the next video.